All right, here we go, Tuesday morning, and it's Taco Tuesday. So let's get our trade on. This is our zero DTE butterfly trades, and we're testing out three different widths. Again, zero DTE. So let's go to the option chain. We'll open up the option chain. We'll go down to at the money. So we're going to put the first one. It's going to be the first one we'll look at is a 15 point wide butterfly with the short strikes at the money. So I'll say analyze by trade butterfly so right now we're trading SPX is trading at 5109 so we'll say the middle is 5110 and then we'll go 15 points above it and 15 points below it so there's our first butterfly risk of 420 So I'm going to lock that guy in, and then I'm just going to right-click and say Analyze Trade to duplicate that trade. And for the second one, this one will be, this one will be a 20-point wide. So I'll take, take the lower strike down by 5 points, take the upper strike up by 5 points. So there we go. There's our 20-pointer. And we'll lock that price in. And then we'll do one more. So I'll say Analyze Trade. This one will be 25 points wide. So I'll change this to uh, 85, is that right? And this one to 35. So 10, let's see, that's not quite right, is it? Yeah, that's 25 points on the upside and 25 points on the downside. So now uh, this one has moved down. SPX is now at 506, so I'm going to shift this middle strike to the 5105. like so and I might as well make them all the same here so I'm going to lock in that big one then I'm going to come back to the 20 pointer I'm going to take that to 5105 in the middle 5150 so there's 20 points let me unlock that make sure that new price is there there's a price on that one okay we got two of them and I'll go back to the 15 pointer and we'll change that middle strike to 5105 5120 so that's 15 points and 15 points and I'll lock that price I'll lock that price in I'll lock that price in and I'll lock that price in okay so there's our three butterflies off and running uh, I got some stuff I got to run around and do, but I'm going to try to check in on these every 15 minutes or so till 8.30. So, here we go. Okay, here we go. 7.21, quick update on our, on these trades. Here is our 15-pointer uh, showing a profit of 20 bucks, 10 to 20 bucks on that one. And here is, oh, what's going on here? Let me check that again. Okay, so... The 15 pointer is up about 20, 20 bucks, fluctuating around there. Our 20 pointer, 20 point butterfly is up about 25 bucks. Oh, there's 40. 20 to 30, let's say. And then our final 25 point wide butterfly is up about 40 bucks. $46. There's 50. Okay, so that's it for this one. I'm going to check back in in about 15 minutes or so, and we'll see where we go from here. Okay, here we go. Check in at 742. Here's our butterflies. So here's our 15-point butterfly. This position is up, showing 60, 70 bucks. So this is most likely hit profit target on this one. That's our 15-pointer. Here's our 20-point Butterfly, this one is showing a profit of about 80 bucks. So if we have a profit target of 75 on this one, then we've hit that one. So that's good. And then our last one is this 25 point butterfly. This one is showing a profit of 120. So this one hit profit target as well. So I'm just going to continue to monitor these out uh, this morning. We'll check in a couple more times and then we'll do the midday update and the final end of day settlement update. 
but so far all these look great they're all profit they've all hit profit target and looking good all right we'll see in a bit okay here we go eight o'clock and here's our 15 wide butterfly we're just checking in on all these this one's up 60 ish bucks so that's looking good we already hit our profit target in the last update but we'll just continue to monitor this and see how much profit this thing can actually produce so this one's up 60 bucks that's the 15 point wide here is the 20 point wide this one is showing a profit right now of about 80 ish bucks so the profit target on this one was 75 dollars so we've hit the profit target on that and then one more let's come down here and do the 25 point wide so here's the 25 point wide the profit target on this one is 100 and it's currently showing a profit of about 120 so all those are looking good still we got uh it's eight so we'll do another quick update around 8 15 and then the final one at 8 30 and then we'll do a mid-morning update like around 10 10 30 ish and then a final settlement check-in all right see you soon okay here we are 8 19 this is our 8 15 ish checkup and you can see we've moved down pretty good here we're outside the tent and this is the 15 point wide butterfly. This one is showing a loss of uh, 90 ish, 90 or 100 bucks. So that's the 15 point wide. Let's look at the 20, 20 point wide butterfly. This one's outside the tent and showing a loss of 180 ish, 180. And then the, uh, the last one, the 25 point wide, is outside the tent. And showing a loss of 268, 270 ish. So we've had a good move down in the SPX over the last 10 minutes or so. So we'll come back one more check in at 8 30, see how, how they all look, and then we'll do the other two the mid morning uh, check in around 10, and then the final closing market settlement. All right, see you soon. Okay, here we go. This is our final morning update. It's 8.40, so I'm a little late here. Uh, but So here is our 15-point wide butterfly. You can see that we're pretty far outside the tent now. We've had a nice, pretty strong down move going on in the SPX and everything else. So right now, this 15-point wide position is showing a, a loss of 153. And let's look at the middle one. This is the 20-point wide. So the 20 point wide trade is uh, showing a loss of 280 ish. It's outside the tent. And then the last one, the 25 point wide is outside the tent showing a uh, loss of about 415. So there is the morning session done. So we had the, uh, we did have the opportunity to take it off at the, at our, at our predetermined profit targets and a little bit more than that. I think we made more like, all of them i think all three uh had profits in that exceeded the profit targets that we had uh but then there's this down move here that we've just had within the last 20 minutes or so it's taken us outside the tent and put us at a loss so that's it for the morning session i'm going to check back in around 10 or 10 30 pacific coast time look at the midday update and then one final one at the end of the day see where everything settles all right that's it for this one Okay, here we go, 10.30. This is our midday, no, our mid-morning update. And here's our butterflies. So this is the 15-point butterfly. You can see we're trading down here. The SPX has continued to move down today. So right now we're down here with, uh, we're, this position is showing a loss of 300 bucks. That's the 15-point wide. Let's take a look at the 20-point wide. Here's the 20-point wide. This one is down, showing a uh a current loss of 520 like say 530 and then the last one is the 25 point wide butterfly that one's right here and showing a current loss of 734 so there are the three positions at the mid-morning update we'll see you at the end of day at the settlement All right here we are the market just closed down it's 108 p.m california time and here's the final look at the butterflies for today so here is the the 15 pointer 
we had a big move down right at the end. You can see the SPX is down 80 for the day. That's pretty good. Uh, so we wound up with this position right here. So we took the full loss on it, which was 375 bucks. So that's the 15 pointer. Here is the 20 pointer. You can see that uh, here's the, we're far outside the 10 on this one as well. You can see our full uh, loss on this one is 670. So we took the, the max loss on that one if we had held it on till uh, the end of the day. And then the final one is on, this is the 25 point wing and same as the others, we're outside the 10 all the way down, taking the max loss on this. Uh, the max loss on this is 1,005. So with all these, if we had held on to these, if we had gotten into these and held on to them, they, you can see we they wouldn't have worked out on this one. However, these trades did hit profit target and then some at the uh, by the end of the morning session. So we'll just take all that info and data and stick it in our pipe and smoke it, which reminds me, I forgot to update my Excel sheet. So uh, and I can't do it right now because I got I got a bunch of stuff going. Today's kind of a nutty day. So I'll do that tonight. I'll update the Excel sheet for all of these trades. And then tomorrow's trade, we'll have it all rearing and ready to go. So again, on this trade, we, we, uh, we made profit target on all three butterflies. If our plan was to take profit target. They all hit the profit target within like the first hour and they could have been taken off. If we held on till mid morning, we would have seen a loss at mid morning. And then if we held on till end of day, uh, we would have seen a loss. So that's kind of the whole point of this testing that we're doing, just to get a general idea of like how, what kind of profit we can get, what time frame we can get it in and how consistently does it stay in the tent or wind up outside the tent at end of day. And then we can uh, hopefully take all that info and make sense of it and create a workable trading plan. So anyway, if you'd like to follow along with me on this trade, just make sure you're subscribed to my YouTube channel below. Hit that subscribe button and also be sure to join me on my website. I'll leave a link to my website in the description below. Head on over there, sign up for my free email newsletter. When you do that, you'll get a welcome email sent to you right away. Just reply back to that welcome email. Say, hey, what's up? I'll reply to you and we'll go from there. All right, please hit that like button and leave a comment. And we'll see you tomorrow.